Good evening, cruisers. How you doing out there? It is a uh, time machine tonight, and I have come from the future, and I want you to know the blues is alive and well. In 2069, Keith Richards is still alive. People are still going on blues cruises, and everything's all good, so don't worry about any of that. Right now, we are ready to celebrate one of my favorite artists, and I'm sure one of yours, because you're all in this room right now. Grammy Award winner, Blues Music Award winner, Blues Music nominee. Put your hands together for Tom Hambridge and the Rattlesnakes.
Good to see everybody. Thank you so much for coming out to the show here. Um, uh, this is a uh, tonight. I'm going to do a bunch of songs I've written for a lot of different people and some songs off my new album. But uh, this is a song that uh, I want to do. It's a song I wrote for George Thurgood and the Destroyers. You know those guys. So uh, it's got a very important finger snap part. And I know since you're all music lovers and music connoisseurs and uh, probably musicians and singers, you're going to have no problem with the finger snap part. So we're going to hit you with it right now. It's called The Fixer. It goes like this. One, two, three. gets it done. gets it done. gets it done. I just snap my fingers and the fixer gets it done. Hell, I just snap my finger <laughs> and the fixer gets it done. I'm your fixer, baby. F I X H E R. song, tender little love ballad I wrote about my mama that the great band Leonard Skinner recorded. Yeah. I was raised on the south side of Shannon didn't get up until the sun went down. When your back's against the wall, you better get I was born in the street, I know the sunshine Yeah, looking women back was a moon shot Learned more about life on the street than in the school Sweet mama didn't raise no fool Look in his eye, so don't hear me 
Jack, try to call a cola. I know the difference between shit and shine. I know that I was born in a sweet hot for the sunshine. Mama didn't raise no food. But she taught me right from wrong And she said every single word And every note of every song She taught me how to gamble How to roll the dice She said if it makes you feel good Do it, don't think twice I was born in a sweet hot For the sunshine Got a looking woman back in woods and moonshine Learning more about life On the street than in the school Women back in woods and moonshine Learn more about life on the street than in the school Sweet mama didn't raise no fool No, she didn't I wrote another song with the word mama in it and a buddy guy recorded it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that one on you right now. <laughs> Hit me guys.
solid love insurance. And I know I'm getting in good hands. Number one is not around. For Johnny Winter, and it got nominated for a Grammy, and I was so happy for him. He deserved it so much. And it's a little thing called the Long Wolf. Get a good friend up here that uh, plays some keyboards with us. This is a friend I've known a long time. He's actually the keyboard player for the Kenny Wayne Shepherd Band. Everybody, give a give a round of applause to Joe Crown.
He's a, come on, Joe Crown, everybody. Here he is. You know, Joe Crown, uh, many years ago I used to uh, play drums and I was the band leader for Chuck Berry. And uh, we did a lot of crazy gigs. And uh, gosh, there's a whole book in there. <laughs> but uh, now that I think about it, but uh, we were reminiscing actually last night about one of the shows and uh, up in Buffalo at Melody Fair, right? That was a freaky night. It was a great show, but uh, anyway, this is the great Joe Crown and uh, he's gonna he's gonna help me with a song that's on my new record, The Nola Sessions. Hey, thank you. I've been making a lot of records for a lot of other people and uh, it felt good to make a record for myself, and uh, I went down to New Orleans and, and recorded this record with a lot of my heroes, um, like Sonny Landreth and the guys from the Neville Brothers, and but all these great bands, Dr. John's guys, and um, Sonny Landreth, did I say that? Ooh. Yeah, all these wonderful players. And, um, but one of the highlights was uh, I wrote a song called The Blues Has Been Mighty Good to Me, and uh, I said to the people at the studio, hey, is there any way we can call Alan Toussaint, you know? And uh, they were telling me, well, he's not going to come out and do anything. And I said, you know, that's probably right, probably right, but can we just call him? But we ended up calling him, and uh, he asked me uh, if he could hear the song. So I sent him the song, and uh, he called back and said, yeah, where are you recording? And I said, well, we're right down the street. <laughs> so he came out to the studio, and it was unbelievable. He played piano and sang a duet with me on this song, and uh, it, it, it was amazing and one of the highlights of my life. And um, it's on the new album. And, but it ended up actually being one of the last performances he ever did, because as you know, he passed away right after that. And um, so uh, I'm forever blessed and to have this piece of music, and I want to play it for you right now. And Joe's going to be Alan Toussaint tonight. This is uh, called The Blues, Been Mighty Good to Me. Just 
like an old friend See the blues been mighty good to me Some say the blues is the devil Poison to the soul Like too much cocaine and whiskey It's bound to take its toll Only thing it's good for is Bad luck and misery But I couldn't live without it. See the blues been mighty good to me Mighty good to me Just like an old friend See the blues Been mighty good To me I tried to, it was like a little bit of a test. I went down there with like uh, nothing really prepared. And uh, I kind of wrote the songs down there because I wanted to write them in New Orleans, you know, to get that flavor. And so I was up one night late trying to think of what to come up with for the session in the morning. And uh, I remembered playing in New York City. I told you this yesterday, I think. Um, I remember playing in New York City. I used to play drums for uh, Roy Buchanan, too. So I was on tour with him a long time ago when I was a lot younger. Yeah, great Roy Buchanan. Oh, yeah. And uh, anyways, we were at the Lone Star in New York. A lot of great artists would come out to see Roy. And uh, I was in the dressing room after the show, hanging out, having a drink with Dr. John, the night tripper. And he goes, hey, Tom, man, this, this line of work I can highly recommend. Like I mentioned yesterday, I, I, uh, I, I couldn't understand whether he said highly recommend or hardly recommend. <laughs> and I was afraid to ask him. And then later on in life, the longer I played, I thought, I think it could be both. <laughs> and so I was, I was up like two in the morning writing this song in uh, New Orleans and I had to put this line in it. So I, you'll hear that line go by. And I figured it's only proper. I'm in New Orleans writing these songs, so I should use that line. And uh, it's called Blues Crazy. They've been playing this one on the radio.
Right, so uh, I produced a lot of records and wrote a lot of songs for this young artist named Quinn Sullivan. You know Quinn Sullivan, right? He's great. And uh, so I want to go back and do, uh, I'll play some drums. And uh, this is a song, I was always inspired by a lot of instrumental songs that used to be on the radio. Whether it was like Walk Don't Run or Green Onions or all these really cool instrumentals. And I haven't heard a lot in a while, so I decided to write one for him. And they play it on the radio, so it's a little thing called Cyclone. We're gonna lay it on you here. There was another request of a song we haven't done in a long time, but uh, it's about my daughter. Yeah, a little bit more, that'd be great. Uh, you know, uh, when me and my wife had our first baby, it's a little red-headed girl, and I would come home from uh, doing a concert like this, and, uh, and uh, her name was Rachel, and she was not sleeping at night, you know, so she was not sleeping at all. And uh, I'd come home from the gig, and my wife would greet me at the door, with this little baby and go, here you go. 
So I'd be up all night with her, and uh, I was just trying to think, you know, I make a living as a songwriter and all that, and I thought, I wonder if I can write a nursery rhyme or some sort of song to see if I can get her to go to sleep. So this is what I came up with. Put it right to sleep. <laughs> Out like a light. I couldn't believe it. The harder I played, the faster I played, the more soundly she slept. Which was good. So I carried on with the song like this in one. Rachel Faye's a good girl, I got to treat her nice Rachel Faye's a good girl, she keeps me up all night She's my little redhead, Lord, my little redhead girl Rachel Faye's a sweet tart, she's sweet like pink champagne My baby's got more sugar than the sugar cane She's my little redhead, Lord, my stinking redhead girl she got red, 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 red all over her head. Can't wait to pop her in the bed. <laughs> Rachel Faye's an angel. She kept down from above. I guess God sent down this angel just to teach me how to love. She's my little redhead, Lord, my little redhead girl. She got red, 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 red all over her head. Can't wait to tuck her in the bed. Take my money, take everything I own. I got all that I can handle waiting back at home. See my little redhead, my little redhead girl. She got red, 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 red all over her head. Can't wait to tuck her into bed.
Not so long, all right. Somebody else you back? I had a bunch of questions here. I'm going to do that. Uh, I don't think we got that one prepared just yet, Masterpiece, but... Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll be working on that. Well, I, I, I worked on this one because somebody asked me for this one. This is a song I did last cruise. And it's on one of my CDs, and it's called The Shoe Box. Oh, there you go. And so me and Steve are going to give you this one. Here. And then I'll do Upside the Moment. I stumbled on a bunch of junk of mine In a shoe box the other night was in between cleaning up piles of messes that I've made of my life. Ticket stubs, love poems, and old letters. I dumped them all out on the bed. And I found a homemade birthday card for mom. And this is what it said. Yeah, this is what it said. Don't forget the little moments, cause they're the ones that mean the most. And when your way home seems so far away, take them out and hold them close. And take a picture with your father, cause one day he'll be gone. And don't forget to fill an old shoebox full of things to look back on. Full of things to look back on. Summertime, I was turning nine. He said, You want that knife? It's yours. And I remember running off in the yard and I carved my name in every tree. I haven't held it since he passed away, but it meant the world to me. Because he meant the world to me. So don't forget the little moments, they're the ones that mean the most. When your way home seems so far away, take a mile and hold the close. Take a picture with your father, cause one day he'll be gone. And don't forget to fill an old shoebox full of things to look back on. To look back on, cause it's a little window to the past. Look back on. Cause God knows a life goes by so fast But if ever you should ever doubt All the blessings that you've had but Don't forget the little moments yeah, They're the ones that mean the most When your way home seems so far away Just take them out and hold them close Take that picture with your father Cause one day he'll be gone And don't forget to fill an old shoebox Full of things to look back on Full of things to look back on I stumbled on a bunch of junk of mine In a shoebox the other night Yeah, my happy blues song. We're gonna play my happy blues song. <laughs> Come on, one, two, three, ah. Uh. Yeah. I want to get a special guest out here for this song. Got a great horn player in the house, saxophone player, Mark Early. Is he around somewhere, Mark Early? He can catch up to us as well. Victor Rainwright's band, the group 
full of blues and all kinds of great stuff. Yeah, blow a little bit, come on.
talking about? You know, I want to also take a minute to thank uh, everybody that was responsible for having Tom Hammers and the Rattlesnakes on this cruise. I mean, yeah, that's your cruisers out there. Thank you for whatever you got to fill out and do. Thank you for having us. We appreciate it greatly. Thank Roger for having us. It's such a ball and uh, an honor to be here with all these great bands. And uh, also want to give a hand to the to the, the guys doing the crew here, the sound guys, the monitor guys. Can we can we give them a hand for taking care of all these bands all day long? And all day long. I'd like to get my good friend Sandy Mack out here to play some keyboards. Sandy McDonald, everybody. Can we have a hand for Sandy Mack over here? We're gonna play some B3. Ah, I like that. We're gonna start you off. This is a song I wrote for uh, a girl that uh, named Susan Tedeschi a long time ago. Yeah. And uh, I was uh, asked to produce a record and write songs for her. And, uh, in Cambridge, Massachusetts, many, many years ago, so uh, it was it was wonderful to work on this record, it was called. It ended up calling it uh, Just Won't Burn, was the name of the record, and um, yeah, and what was great about it is I remember the, the record company was saying, listen, because I wrote this song, and it had the word rock in the title, and uh, they were a little nervous. They said, listen, we, we want the blues fans to like this record, and uh, it's got the word rock in the title. And I said, well, one of my favorite songs is Rock Me Baby, right? There's a lot of rocks, right? And uh, anyway, so it, it worked out great. Um, they were hoping to sell about 5,000 copies of this record. And, uh, and I remember I was in the studio, I said, 5,000 copies, we're gonna sell a million copies. And they looked at me like I had three heads. But it, what ended up being wonderful is that it sold a couple million copies, which was wonderful. And, uh, yeah, and she's a star, and it's awesome to watch. And so, anyways, this is the first song I wrote for the record called Rock Me, right? It was the first song on the record. <laughs>
when your stomach starts growling, I know what you need. I'm gonna fix you up some salty and yeah, sweet. Homemade cooking always does the trick. The cotton ain't rotten, just needs to be picked. Of this one, so this is a song I wrote for a buddy guy a long time ago. I've been around a while, I know a wrong from a right. Learned a long time ago, things ain't always black and white, and just like you can't judge a book. By the cover, we all got to be careful how we treat one another. Skin deep, skin deep is underneath. We're all the same. Alright, mom. 
was old enough to know I said out there in this great big world you're gonna need all kinds of folks I said son it all comes down to just one simple rule that you treat everybody just the way you want them to treat This is Sal Baglio on the guitar, everybody. Tommy McDonald on the bass guitar. David Fox on the drums. Steve C on the guitar. Sandy McDonald on the B3. Thank you so much for coming out. I'm gonna finish up with a, with a song here, the, the Way I Feel. The Way I Feel, I had a good time. You had a good time? Yeah. Man, well. This is a song I wrote down in Mexico with Doug Room Clinton, and I want to rock it out one time. Can we, can we nail that? I always throw different songs at these guys all the time, so. It's pretty impressive. They just, even if they don't know it, they don't tell me, they just start playing. And then I start trying to remember what the lyrics are, so. Whatever, man, let's hit it. Come on!
something new Have I had a real good time? I do like brown wine and the Rattlesnakes. Woo, that was fun, wasn't it? Brand new record is out and Tom will swing by over there by the Blues and Bazaar if you're going to pick one up tonight and get it signed. It'd be a good time to do that before they run out because as you know, everything on the ship is an import so it's always good to get the CDs early. Get them signed by your favorite artist and pick that up. Once again, put your hands together for Grammy Award winner, Blues Music Award winner, Blues Music nominee, Tom Hambridge and the Rattlesnakes. We've got the legendary review coming up, the original legendary Rhythm and Blues review with Tommy Castro Band, also Magic Dick, Ronnie Baker Brooks, and Deanna Bogart coming up next on this stage right here. So refresh your drink, get your dancing shoes on, and get ready for some more fun. Let's hear it once again for Tom Hambridge and the Rattlesnakes. Yeah. 